All right, we've got four challenge stars now. I forget how many are there are total. I think ten. They're all pretty simple to find, though. So. Okay, here's another one. Now we've got five. Now pressing this is going to make these blocks move around. And creepy music will start. Okie dokie. Let's do that so I don't have to wait super long for this one to come around. Ooh, this timing is a little off. Can you jump that far? Yes, you can. Jump in there, thank you. I remember this jump was hard for me when I was younger because his head kept hitting on the archway and he would just fall into the stuff. Don't jump too far, man. Alright, this one, yeah, that's going to go all the way. Alright. Pendo! Pendo! Jump. Some creepy person is laughing at me. Harry, don't observe your wand. You're on moving platforms over a bottomless pit of death. And you're concerned with how your wand looks? Pendo! Apparently the ghost doesn't think so. Don't look behind you! Well, at least he didn't pick his nose this time. Okay. And beans. Beans, beans. Lots of beans, lots of beans. Uh, I'm gonna have to wait for the platform to come back. Come back, platform. I miss you. Oh, it's kind of jerking along. Alright. Get on that. I'll start that already. Okay. I have to wait for it to come back. But I think this is the last one. Jump. And I don't remember if this one goes all the way to the end or not. No. Okay. What do we have now? Nothing on that side. Save game book. Aha, the gnomes. These guys gave me so much trouble when I was younger. Oh this man. No, Mr. Potter. They like to pester young wizards. Knock him on his backside to complete the challenge. Okay. They move quickly and can be quite a nuisance. Yeah, apparently the gnomes in this game, as soon as you knock them over, they just kind of stay down forever. Uh, we want... There's one over here between the couches. I know that. Let's see if maybe I can get him to charge me. No. You're just gonna stand there? Oh, I can't get him from here anyway. Can I get that one? No. No, bad gnome. Ooh, someone is happy. Oh, that one scared me for a second. I thought it was not on its butt. Hey, Bertie bots, every flavor bean. My favorite. And let's get this star, because that would kind of be pretty stupid of me to just exit without the last star. C Congratulations, Mr. P Potter. You completed the challenge. Yay! You collected all the challenge stars. 20 p points for Gryffindor. Now, hurry on to broomstick practice. Okay. Back in their Gryffindor common room, Harry, Ron, and Hermione talked about their exciting first days at Hogwarts. There was much talk about the break-in at Gringotts Wizard Bank. 
But there was little time to dwell on this, since Harry and his friends were expected at their flying lesson with Madame Hooch. All right, flying time. I am your instructor, Madame Hooch. For your first lesson, you will fly through these magic rings. Control your broom with the direction keys. The speed up and slow down keys adjust your flight speed. Really? I couldn't have figured that one out. Ready, Potter? On my whistle, then. Alright, I need to check if I changed the g controls. A or X. Okay. So... That's what I thought I did, but I wasn't sure. Alright, we need speed and get up a little bit. I'm not particularly good at this part, so we'll see how well I can do. Now let's see how you do with smaller ones. Go there. Well done, Mr. Potter. Thank you. So far so good. Alright, I can hopefully handle that. This is like the one time in the game where you actually have a flying lesson. These rings should challenge you. Ooh dear, I'm off course. Alright. Do the challenging rings, Harry. Oh yeah, and I almost forgot. Let's get this ring. What are you doing, idiot? Don't do that. Go in here, get the card. And now we'll go back out, because I don't care about the beans. Alright, that's a secret area. With one of the ever-important wizard cards. Speed. Speed, sir. Alright. Well, I should at least get to the... To the red ones. Oh, no! Let's try it with moving rings. Yes, the moving rings. Okay. Do these moving rings. Up. And down here. There we go. I don't think I'm going to get a perfect score, but that's fine. Yeah, close enough. A skillful display, Mr. Potter. 15 points for Gryffindor. I Yay. also congratulate you for being the first student to find the secret room since 1867. Oh my. From now on you, you may practice flying boy, at Harry. any time. You will find the option on the main menu. <laughs> he looks so silly. Time for your chance <laughs> now. Good day, Mr. Potter. I'm glad that you know my schedule. It's also kind of funny if you go down and like bump into those people while you're flying, they'll all be like, ouch, ouch. That hurts. Don't do that. And zapping these things usually makes them spit beans. Flipendo, flipendo. Oh, you have another one? Do you have another one? Yes, you do. Okay. That should be all. Let's get this. Alright. I'm actually going to use this save game book later. Because Hermione here is going to for the lesson, Harry, but I'll teach you be Hermione. I learned on my own. The spell I learned is out of Hamora. It will open magically locked things, but don't get into any mischief. Don't count on that. This is the symbol for Ala Hamora. When I stop, hold down the mouse button and make the same pattern. Then let go of the button. Okay. Uh, hopefully I can do that. Straight lines are really hard with this mouse. Okay. 
How is that, Hermione? Did I please you? Yes, I, I think I did. That was brilliant, Harry. Great, Harry. I'm sure Professor Flitwick would give you five house points for that I love how she's able to give You're house points. <laughs> oh, why did you start the clock before you'd even finished talking? Look, now you screwed me up. Oh my god, my mouse. Hopefully that was at least good enough to pass me on to the next round. Okay, good. That was good, but I know you could do even better. That was okay. really well done, Harry. Professor Flitwick would award you at least ten house points. You're getting the hang of this. Well, why didn't you give me more? If it was at least... We're friends, right? 